Welcome back to the channel. I am Mr. Lado, and today we have a special, special review. So sit tight and get right, and let's start the review. Cut! That was good. Clear! You nailed it! Thank you. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, stay true here. Hit that like and subscribe button to make sure you get notifications. Leave a comment if you feel like it. If you're wondering why, why is he so laid back? Why he's so chilled out? Because this review takes that type of atmosphere. Just this that type of review, you just can't go in it. Oh, you know, loud and rambunctious. So today. Our review is of Crazy. Oh, you gotta say it one more time. Say crazy. Mike Todd's crazy face. That's what we are reviewing today. And I know you're looking for donuts, you're looking for pizza, you're looking for burgers, all this different little stuff. But I think this right here is good food for the thought. And who would I be if I didn't give you good food for your thoughts? So check this out. I have become an advocate reader now. Back in the day when I was growing up, I make it sound like I'm old, but I'm not. But when I was coming up, I really did not like reading until I found that there's so much knowledge. There's you gain so much understanding and reading. So with this book right here, I said I had to do a review on it. I had to let my people know that this information is out there. Now, my top. As you say at your church, you keep it hot, humble, open, and transparent. So which means I got to keep it hot with you. Humble, open, and transparent. This book, it's amazing, man. Um, I like how you broke down the different variations of faith. Because I think a lot of times we lose the essence of what faith truly is and how important it is just to believe just to have baby faith just to have wavy faith just to have these different areas of faith i'm not going to go into all the different faith that he's done but i will tell you this if you have doubts about faith if you do not understand how faith works and you're wondering okay and especially if you're new in this thing and you want to know how faith is activated and the full breakdown of faith, this book right here will lead you in the right direction. I must say, it was a good read. It was a great read. I encourage everybody who is struggling in their faith, uh, want to know about faith, to get this book. Crazy faith is crazy good. It doesn't get any better than this, than crazy faith. Of course, I've been also listening to your Siri, Crazy Earth Faith, which is, I must say, pretty good. So, I give this book a five all day as a good read. I know, you know, so I think I might start doing this more often. I want to let y'all into my life. When I review things, when I try things out, I think I'm just going to bring it to the table. So the link for the book will be in the description. If you would like to know more about this book, reach out to Transformation Nation. Um, it's truly a good read. And I think everybody should actually take time to read this book. One thing I took away from this book the most important thing about faith is that you really don't need a lot of faith. The Bible speaks about having faith of a mustard seed. A mustard seed is not that big. So that means whatever you want to start in life, whatever you want to do in life, all it takes is that small little seed. Mustard seed. So, like we always say around about this time, keep God first and the rest 
will be added. And remember, it's all for the love of knowledge. Love you. See you on the next review.